We immediately put a sign up in the window requiring that people wear masks. That was Kitchen Table's response to the CDC's mask recommendations last week. I mean, our, our, we feel our responsibility is, is to our employees and our, and our customers. It's, you know, they, they don't have a choice whether or not uh, others get vaccinated. So we feel in order to stay open and provide the service that we, that we want to provide, um, we really have to enforce that mandate. On top of health concerns, there is the scare that if the spread continues to grow like it is, that it will cause another big hit to local businesses. That's really a scary thing going into, you know, going into the fall. It, um, you know, June was great, I think, for everybody here in Omaha um, with the College World Series back and, and a lot of people in town and it, it felt almost normal again. Um, and I think we have to be really careful about falling into the trap of living our wish as opposed to the reality. And now that the CDC announced that while they don't have as severe of symptoms, vaccinated individuals can spread strains as well. There's no way to tell who's vaccinated and who's not. There's so much debate over it. And, you know, that's really not, it's really not our business. It's, we can only do what's best for the people who are here and who have to be here. And, you know, I think we just have to continue. We have to, you know, stay the course and, and get through this together. It's the only way to do it. All in all, making the choice for kitchen table and other local businesses an easy one. It's not a decision we're making. It's it's something that we feel we have to do uh, in support of you know public health in general. Reporting in Omaha, Zach Williamson, 3 News Now.